Well, today what I'm going to show you, your outdoor edge tip, is going to be how to properly cape out an animal. Now here I've got an antelope that I shot, and I'm going to cape this out. You want to cut, and deer, elk, everything else for a full mount, they've usually got a little line of hair along their neck. So what we're going to do is we're going to follow that little hairline, and we go up to here. Now I'm going to cut basically a V from the back of each horn. But antelope are unique in that they have a hairy sheath. So what I'm going to do is cut right at the base of this horn. And you'll notice I'm going to pull the hair down. And I'm going to make a little incision all the way around the base of this horn. And by pulling the hair down, you give the taxidermist a little more room to work with. So when he mounts that, any cut, the, uh, the horn base will be covered up just like it was when the animal was alive. Now the next thing is I'm going to V right here and meet our original cut. So here I'm going to come up and I actually pinch the hide on both sides there. I slide the knife up and you'll see I'm just lifting it up. Okay, so you can see I've met the uh, cut around the horn right there and now I'm going to cut right here to finish my V. You can see there I've got that flap skinned out between the horns. Now I'm going to start working around the edge here of the hide in the back. Okay, now I'm coming to the back of the eye socket, and you can not only feel it on this side, but you can see the bump of the eye socket right here. And again, I'll take that and flip it over. I'll put my finger right in the corner of the eye, the back of the eye, and then I'll pull that back. And you know exactly where your finger is, so you wanna just cut along the base of that eye, of course, without cutting your finger. But you also wanna keep both the inner and the eye outer eyelid on that animal. And this is one thing that gets people. Here's the corner of the mouth on the outside, but the corner of the mouth inside is actually way back here. So by putting your finger back in the corner here, you can see where it goes into the jaw, and you can cut right through that, and you'll feel the teeth. And now I'm gonna follow the gum line. One more little cut right here, and there we go. There we have a beautiful antelope cape. I'll turn it inside out so you can see. And there's a beautiful cape that's ready to go to the taxidermist. 